today we have a, a quote like a song, let's say like a lyric from a song. Uh, it says, set your life on fire, seek those who fan your flames from Rumi. Right. We have clients that um, were seeking people to fan their flames. It's, it's like it's a light motive in the coaching sessions, right? Which is that the question that comes again and again in my clients, uh, do you think that I will make it? Do you think that I could, whatever, get uh, this job or that promotion or that function or that exam? So, and why do I start with that? Because is like they need somebody who fend their flames in order to go further, right? So what I'm saying is that every single coaching session has that this question, whether explicitly or implicitly. And what the clients are looking for, therefore, is to me, for me to fan their flames, to support them, to encourage them, to inspire, energize in, in that, um, let's say, endeavor. So um, uh, let me quote uh, the situation of uh, yesterday. Uh, yesterday evening, I had a coaching session with a youngster a young Italian, let's say 30 years old, and um, and he's going for a selection process uh, in the institutions and is the first time he goes through a selection process, right? So obviously he's very, uh, first of all, he doesn't know what to expect, but then it's uh, quite, uh, um, let's say, afraid whether he's able to do it, whether he he will make it, you know, again, the same question, right? We, we are in the same question. And I would say that this question comes not only uh, in uh, the youngster 30 years old, they come in the 40 and 50 years old, it's the same, we are talking about the same human insecurities about our ability to do things. And uh, so, he started the session with that big insecurity about whether he's able or not to do. And then we went through that particular exam that uh, we are we were preparing yesterday evening. And uh, at the end uh, of the session, he was, uh, let's say, calm, serene, uh, confident, uh, positive about. And um, well, I would say, so what was the difference in, between the beginning of the session and the end of the session? Well, I would say exactly that. I was there, let's say, to fan his flames. I was there to support and encourage him. Obviously, there is a little bit of knowledge behind all that, but probably the most crucial contribution that I uh, brought in the session was to give him the confidence that, yes, he can do it, right? So we are kind of coming back to what Obama was saying. Yes, you can. Mm -hmm.